English Listening Test, Part 1, designed for A1 learners. This test consists of 20 questions which are divided into three parts. I will give you a short instruction at the beginning of each part. Before we get started, take a pen and paper so you can take notes while listening. Are you ready? Let's get started. Part 1. Listen to three people talking about their favorite rooms. What is in their rooms? Answer to the questions after listening. My name is Maria. My favorite room is my bedroom. It is small but it's very quiet. It has a single bed and a cupboard. There are some shelves on the walls with lots of books on them. There's a desk and a chair next to the window. There's a computer on the desk. I study there every evening. There's a great view of the city from the desk. My name is John. My favorite room is our dining room. There's a really big old table in it and six chairs. We have great meals here with our friends, but I also use the table to play games and work. There are some lovely interesting things in this room. There's also a really old lamp from China on the table and there's a big expensive rug from Japan on the floor. It's really beautiful and there are some wonderful paintings on the wall by a Spanish artist. It's a really interesting room, I think. I am Sophie. My apartment only has one room. So, that's my favorite room I guess, but it's a great room. It's on the top floor of a building above some shops. It's really big. It has a double bed and a big sofa. I eat my meals on that because I don't have a table. There's a kitchen area in the corner with a sink and a cooker and there's a really big fridge for drinks and snacks. It's a great room. My friends love to come here and listen to music. What is not in Maria's favorite room? Lamp What's in John's favorite room? Paintings What is in Sophie's favorite room? Double bed. Part 2. Listen to 5 people talking about their jobs. For questions 4 to 14, choose the correct answer. I'm Rodri. I wear a smart uniform at work. I go to the airport and prepare the plane for the passengers. Then I meet the passengers. I give them drinks and food. I talk to them. I love my job because I can visit different countries. I'm Anna. I work in a school. There are 25 children in my class and they are all 7 or 8 years old. They are funny and friendly, but they are often naughty too. Classes finish at 3 o'clock, but I always have to prepare classes and check the children's work in the evenings. My name is Smith. I work in a big hotel. I prepare food for the guests. I also have to order food and put it in the correct cupboard, fridge or freezer. All the food must be safe and the kitchen must be clean. I like my work because I'm always busy. But one day, I'd like my own restaurant. Then I can make new, exciting meals. I am Amanda. I wear a uniform at work, a t-shirt and black trousers. It's not very smart, but it's comfortable. I am on my feet all day in the store. I have to help customers work at the cash desk and get sneakers from the room upstairs. And I have to tidy up because there are often balls and clothes on the floor of the store. 
My work isn't very interesting. I hope to get a different job soon. My name is James. I sometimes work in the day and sometimes at night. I work with children here at the hospital. I give them their medicine and check that they are okay. Some of the children are very sick and that's really sad. I play with the children and talk to their families. It's great when they get well and can go home. Rodri is a flight attendant. Rodri travels a lot. Anna is a teacher. Anna has to do some work in the evenings. Smith is a chef. Smith would like to work at a different place in the future. Amanda is a store assistant. Amanda is not happy with her job. Lucy doesn't like her job. James is a nurse. James plays with the children. Part 3, listen to four different conversations, and for questions 15 to 20, choose the correct answer. Would you like to play tennis on Saturday, John? I'm a little busy on Saturday. What time? In the morning. How about 10 o'clock? Sorry, I'm not free in the morning. How about the afternoon, at about 4 o'clock? Sorry, I'm afraid I can't play then. That's a shame. Maybe another time. Yes, sure. Emma, we're going to a restaurant on Friday. Would you like to come with us? Where are you going, Alex? To the Italian restaurant on High Street. I like that place. What time are you going there? After work? At half past five? No, that's too early to eat. We're going home first and we're meeting at seven o'clock. Hmm, that's not good for me. I don't live near work. Well, do you want to come to my house after work? 
We can have a drink there. Thanks, Alex. That sounds good. Jimmy, do you want to see Romeo and Juliet at the theater next week? Okay. I know you love that play. Thanks, Jimmy. Which day is best for you? Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday? What time does it start? Half past seven. I can't go on Tuesday. I have to stay late that day. And I have football on Thursday. Wednesday then? Yes, that's fine. Great! A country band is playing at the groove next week. Shall we go? Which band is playing? Sheep and cows. Oh, they are good. When are they playing? They're playing on two nights, Thursday and Friday. I can't go on Thursday. I have yoga. But I'm free on Friday. Friday is good for me too. What time do they start? Nine o'clock. But we can meet for drinks first. Yes, let's do that. But let's not meet at the groove. Let's go to the bar in the park. Good idea. Shall we meet there at eight? Yes, that'd be great. What do Yana and John decide to do? They won't play tennis this weekend. What do Alex and Emma decide to do? Go to Alex's house after work and to the Italian restaurant at 7 p.m. What time Linda and Jimmy will see Romeo and Juliet? Seven thirty. Which day will they see the play? Wednesday. When will Liam and Ava see the band Sheep and Cows? Nine p.m. on Friday. What will they do before they see the band? Have a drink in the bar in the park. Don't forget to share your score in the comments section. If you haven't taken our previous listening tests. The playlist link is in the description below. We will upload more listening tests, so don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned. See you in our upcoming videos.